Well, Paul, we've had a little time to let that result sink in. How, uh, how do you feel the game went tonight? Uh, I think we're lucky to get the three points. We've had to work extremely hard. Uh, gave two soft goals away. Scored three really good goals, which I know most managers would say that your goals are good and against goals aren't very good. But I thought the first goal, Liam Ormsby's free kick, great free kick. Second goal, it was a great run from Sparks. He picked the ball up, drove into their half, led it to Josh, um, George Bissett. Uh, and another great cross, and Johnny on the spot, greening, another header. I'm, I'm, I'm amazed how many headers he's got out of these, these runner games. But yeah, he's just in the right place at the right time. He's very brave and put his head in there. And Julie got his goal. Uh, soft goal, right on half time. We didn't. We didn't defend the free uh, the throwing very well, and then Tom Morgan made an absolute worldie of a save, pushed it around for a corner, and you think, well, you've got away with it, and then the score from the corner, which was disappointing, right on half time. Um, so then we start the second half. We had a few words at half time because I wasn't happy because they'd created two or three chances from our own corners, broke away very fast, and we never did what we were supposed to do and could have got caught two or three times on the counter-attack so that was something that we've got to look at uh, but then the second half Terry, Terry pulls you know our, our longest serving player pulled an absolute worldie out of the bag to go 3-1 and you think right we should be able to kick on from here yeah. and within a minute we've again we lost the ball on the right hand side cheaply one ball beat us so 3-2 and it was quite nerve-wracking, you know, you're saying you've been through Mill, as a manager it's it's even worse, you know, Callum Ward looked at me tonight and said, you never sat down all through the game, and I said, I always get nervous when I go to Thackley because I know how difficult it is, on a Tuesday night away at Thackley is one of the hardest games you'll get, so just grateful to get the full three points, seven wins on the bounce, don't think I've ever done it as a manager before, so it's, it's something special, uh, Greening scoring his goal again, uh, Jonathan getting another 90 minutes tonight, so kept the ball really well. Overall, lucky three points, but grateful, and you just move on to Saturday now. Yeah, you've had to make a few changes tonight to your team due to injuries and illness. How do you think the new boys did come into the into the starting lineup? Yeah, I thought the, you know, Vinny, Vinny and Vinny Desi did really well. His movement was excellent. Should have scored early doors. Uh, didn't fancy taking the shot on, uh, but his movement scared them, uh, especially for the first 20 minutes. Tom Chamberlain, full of energy, uh, still a bit raw, but we've got a lot of potential. Uh, Terry came back in, you know, he's our longest serving player and, and played really well tonight alongside Green and, and Liam Osby. Got a wonder goal, so yeah, some positives, a lot of positives to take from the game, um, but we're, we, you know, we're still missing tonight. Uh, Nick Thompson, our captain, was feeling ill. Uh, we rested Josh and Callum's knees not right from Saturday, so we brought a couple of young lads in. Even Tom Gore got on at the end there, made a couple of crunching tackles, full of energy. So yeah, pleased for everybody. Yeah, he managed to get his debut in the uh, injury time. Did young Tom Gore? Yeah, yeah, he's he, you know he's keen as mustard. He's Tom, and he looks like he'll be a proper player as well. Plays very much like yourself, James, when when you were a bit younger and fitter. Yeah, many years ago now. Many years ago. A little mention for the TSC, Tadcaster Supporters Club, tonight out in force um, on a wet Tuesday night in Thackley. <laughs> we think there was nigh on 100 there tonight from Never. Tadcaster. Was there really that Tremendous many? Tremendous turnout. There was a lot of noise, I know that. It puts a bit of pressure on you, really, because they're singing away and I think it lifts other teams, the opposition as well. So. We've got to be able to manage that now and make sure. But great effort on a on a windy, wet, Thackley night. So yeah, it was it was a good effort from everybody. And I think with the other results, that's put us top of the league tonight. So I believe, yeah, I believe there was 900 and something at Shaw Lane for the draw with Athersley. So yeah, we've just got to keep going. It's still early doors, isn't it? We've only played eight games, but seven wins on the bounce is a is a brilliant effort from everybody concerned. Yeah. On to Liber Siege on Saturday, how do, you think that, uh, how do you think that game will go? Picked up a bit of form, Yeah. got another draw tonight. Liber Siege got another draw tonight, yeah. So, 
You don't know. You, you know. You expect to win your home games, and we'll we'll be going out full of confidence to try and get our eighth win. But we won't be complacent. That's what I've said. I've got to manage the complacency now. We we are world beaters. We've still, you know, I don't think we've moved on from 85 percent. So I still think there's something to play with with this squad of players. Yeah, it's definitely going to be a um, a need for a big squad isn't it, this season. And a little mention for the likes of Ashley Hope making the uh, the journey week in week out, not getting much game time. Yeah, you know, Ashley played last night for the uh, eye to eye development team, so he's, he's getting some minutes, and that's what we need to do. We need to look after all the young lads. They're there if we need them, and they never let us down. So it's great attitude shown by them all. Uh, and no, nobody moans whatsoever, they just get on with it. They're very professional about it, and it's going to take a squad effort. You know, Terry was left out on Saturday for Jonathan, and he's come back tonight and scored a worldie. Brilliant. Thanks very much, Paul. Well done. All right, James. Cheers, mate.